obviously both coming from clubs with huge history. Chris, you know, arguably you more so. It becomes a huge weight of expectation. How do you, how do you deal with that? Ah, you know, great experienced players now. A lot of boys experienced down here. Some boys sort of fourth cup final for some of us. So you know, just take a normal as any other game and just you know speak for the build up that's on the Monday. That's an asset though as well, isn't it? You know, you, you come here, you, it's not new for you. You know, you know what it feels like to to run out here. You know, and you can take you can take strength from that, I suppose. Yeah, you know, um, quite fortunate to play in the fourth final. This is my fourth final on Monday. So yeah. Can't take confidence in my, you know, the surroundings, you know, what's expected of you, you know, the day's going to plan out. So, yeah, it can be a bonus for us, but like you said, on the, on yeah. the day anything can happen. That's so. right. Steph, obviously you come from a club that's steep in history as well, you know, but it's been around a long, long time, isn't it? You know, and have you, have you played here before? or? No, nothing like this. So, I think it's the first time for a couple of the boys as well. So, uh, yeah, it should be a good day. So, looking back at the, the run up you've had to the final, what, any games, any, any moments stand out for you in, in, in that Sway Lake tournament so far? Uh, probably quarter final for me the when we played Neath away. Yeah. Uh, obviously Neath a massive rival for us and they were riding high in the league at the time but you know, we went down and beat them twenty three ten I think and it was convincing, wasn't it? To win down an all at any time was quite special, but to do it in the fashion we did as well, you know, that was probably the standard moment for Tony, I think. And yourself? I think it was just the semi finals just to get just to begin here really. Um, you know, Crosskeys haven't done it before, every every step was a final really and uh, yeah, they did front up all the way through, so I think the highlight is all of the games, really. So, you, yeah, again, it, this is something you can draw strength upon, I suppose, is, is the fact that, like you say, every game has been final for you. So, from your point of view, it's just about more of the same, more of the same. Yeah, yeah, the, you know, the boys just got to do what they've been doing for the last couple of weeks. Um, on the back of two losses, really, coming into the game on Monday. But, um, you know, the boys are going to pull up straight to the back of their head, and it's a new occasion, a big step for the boys, so I think they'll... Uh, Hopefully, do well and uh, step up. To yeah, something like, something like I always said is what happens in the past is not going to affect what, affect what happens Monday. You know, irrespective of whether you've played each other, irrespective of the last few results, it's you know we're talking one-off cup final rugby now, and it's it's how you approach it. You know, any anything that come to mind, you're going to say, and you're going to how you're going to approach it from a, from a captaincy point of view. You know, you're going to approach uh, it different. Or? Not really. Yeah, quite laid back as a captain, I'm not really a shouter shout and screamer. It's not really my style. A few of the other boys enjoy doing that so I just let them carry on we just go as normal like it seemed to have been working yeah. last season and this season so we quite laid back as a team have the music on we just relax building up into the game man. will you be speaking ahead before the game Monday or will no you nothing I'll take it a backward seat I will and uh, let the boys carry on who's going to be doing it on the field who's taking over uh, Rob Nash Rob so is he, is he excited looking forward to it yeah hopefully he keeps his discipline man. but uh, <laughs> Yeah, yeah, he, all the boys are looking forward to it, including Rob. He didn't train last night, but I think he'd be fighting fit for the weekend. Best of luck, boys. Hope it goes well and uh, may the yeah. best team win. <laughs>